Hey everyone, welcome back to Just Wing It Woodworking. My name is Zach. If this is your first time here on this channel, I basically just wing everything that I build. Sometimes I have plans. In a previous video, uh, I made cornhole boards that I have done multiple times, so I was actually I actually had plans for that. But in this video, I am going to build a TV stand for a wall-mounted TV. It's basically going to hold all the stuff that goes along with the TV. I, there's a DVD player, some movies. You gotta still have DVDs and VHSs. Everybody's got a VCR. I mean, it's just like a phone book. Everybody's got one. Stick around, and I'm gonna show you the process I use to build this thing. And I'm using Walnut. I'm just, I'm just gonna change the channel name to uh, Just Wing It Walnut. Why not? Oh no! Alright, I now have all the panels glued up. I'm going to cut them to length. I got three shelves, a top, and two sides. And in case you were wondering, these are my awesome plans very thought out plans <laughs> but we're getting there Uh, or what's going to be the sides of the TV stand and I'm going to do it the slow way because I do not have a dado stack for the table saw because my arbor is not big enough so I'm just going to chip away at it
Okay, now that I have the dados cut in the side, I'm gonna make a rabbit on the back to accept the 3 8 plywood that I have that is gonna be the backing for this TV stand. And I'm gonna use a table saw again because it works well. So let's get to cutting. So here I have a sacrificial fence that is just a piece of plywood uh, so that when I cut this rabbit and I have to get real close, the blade doesn't actually cut into my good fence. So if it hits the plywood, no big deal. Just a couple clamps. A lot cheaper than having to buy a new one. That would suck. All right, what I have going on here is I'm attempting to make a little dry mock-up. Um, I'm, I'm gonna attach the bottom with screws because I'm gonna be covering up the screw holes with um, trim. I resawed some trim, as you've seen, and I'm gonna be covering those screw holes up and the other two, since it flies, flies, flies everywhere. Oh my gosh. Um, the other two shelves are just gonna be glued in uh, since I'm going to be using a top, then I'm going to fasten down and a back. It will make it plenty strong. So let's see if I can get this thing put together. Well, it may look like a Frankenstein, but it's together, it's square. I didn't have long enough clamps, so I used two and kind of interlocked them-ish. Got a little diagonal one there. 
But overall, it's looking good so far.
TV stand for the wall mounted TV is done. I made it completely out of walnut. The only thing that is not walnut is the back, which is 3 8 inch plywood. I used a combination of three boards for each panel, glued them up so I could get 15 inches in depth with the 54 inches wide. The top is actually 56 inches, just to have a little bit of overhang, which I used a chamfer bit on the bottom and a roundover bit on the top. I resawed some walnut uh, scrap wood I kind of had left over so I could actually trim the outside to give it a little bit of a depth look. I used uh, boiled linseed oil to finish it and I used uh, four coats of polyurethane, water-based polyurethane on the top and did two coats of polyurethane on the rest of it just to give it a little bit of sheen and shine and protectiveness. So if you've enjoyed this video, please like, maybe think about subscribing if you think I've earned it. Um, I'll catch you in the next video. Thanks for watching.